Okay, so this is a non-calculated trigonometry question. So the way I'll start this is exactly the same as I start any trig question. I'm uh, going to label the sides first. So that's my hypotenuse. Um, this is my opposite down here. And this is my adjacent next to the marked angle and the right angle. And I'm going to cross out the one I don't use, which is the adjacent, because the other twos have values on them. Then I'm going to write out my Sokatoa. So exactly the same process as before. These are three triangles, and you have to remember these. Now we're not going to use this one and this one, because they both have an A in, and we've crossed that out. So we're looking at so. So this um, little triangle says that sine the angle equals the opposite, which is root 3, over the hypotenuse, which is 2. So basically, I need to know what value of sine gives me root 3 over 2. Now, there's a method I've shared in a previous video, which I'm just going to briefly go through. And what you do is you write down the uh, values 0, 30, 45, 60, and 90. And with sine, if you circle one of them, and you put the numbers on the left of the one you've circled over 2, then that's the um, sine value. So, nice and easy. So, let's have a look. The root here is root 3. So I'll need three numbers to the left of the one I circle. So if I circle this one, I'll have three numbers to the left of it, which is, will be root 3, and it's always over 2. So my answer is going to be x equals 60. And whilst you're revising, you can always just find out. You can type in sine 60, and when you type that in, you'll find the answer of root 3 over 2 before you convert it to a decimal.